When I was a kid, I knew that I wanted to play. I knew that I wanted to play in a symphony one day, and I knew I wanted to be a performer. And I think from an early age, uh, I think my parents knew that too, because I didn't want to practice, but I did want to perform. This will be my 30th year coming up teaching, and I've done very little of online teaching. So I think it was panic first, <laughs> trying to figure out what I was going to do with all these kids that needed something to to keep them busy and keep them going. And there was uh, nervousness about what was going on and people were upset. So I've been posting stuff. Sometimes it's for my students that I know need some boost. That's why I do music. That's why I play because I wanna be able to share something and maybe it'll touch somebody's heart too and somebody will relate to words in a song or just the feel of a piece. And there's been a lot of positive feedback. People have appreciated hearing music every day, and it helps. So the Grace Notes are a group of seven teenagers, or preteens. Some of them have been playing together since they were four or five, really. We play lots of things with harmonies, and that's been frustrating over the course of COVID learning because we can't play at the same time. We still have group classes online, um, but what I'll do is mute all of their feeds and they'll play along with me. So it's kind of like having a lesson with me, but I can't hear them at all. So they could play whatever they want, really. <laughs> and uh, I would never know. Uh, so we're all excited to actually be together for the first time since March. Uh, it'll be, it'll be crazy. They're seven teenagers. <laughs> it'll be energetic and it'll be loud and I'm really looking forward to it. I miss the collaboration with other musicians and I miss hearing the other players. That's the hard thing. I know that the students are still practicing and I know that it's all still going on and they're still learning because I see it every week. Um, but I miss hearing their music. Um, some kids are becoming more independent because I can't play along with them all the time. They don't have that. Um, they don't have me to rely on. They have to find something in themselves to to keep on moving. It's not really just about music for me. It's about helping people believe in themselves in some way. And if music can help them do that, that's great. Uh, even if they don't become performers, I'm not trying to create performers. I'm trying to create people that love music and love learning and are patient with themselves when there's something difficult to learn. <laughs>